Good afternoon, everybody. Uh, we are at Media Mana Studio again. This is going to be the last program. So far, we have we had more than twelve or twelve program, yeah. And uh, since last year, 2015, November, we have shown 13 movies to our students. Casablanca, Force Camp, Fifty First Dates, Titanic. The King's Speech, A Beautiful Mind, Meet Joe Black, Gun with the Wind, Shakespeare in Love, Gothica, The Intern, Jane Eyre, and last movie, Breakfast at Tiffany's. And so far at this studio, at I mean Media Manas, we discuss many topics such as showing movies with or without subtitles. Movie choosing criteria, with or without handouts, we can give to our students. They, we want them to watch the movie. And advantages or disadvantages of using movies as an extracurricular activity in both departments in ELT. And we also discussed Jane Eyre. And also, we just talked about movie as part of English teaching curriculum the characters, plot, language used, and literary aspects in the movies, and languages used in the movies, accents, idioms, and context, and also how movies can be used in translation and interpretation departments, simultaneous translation or consecutive translation, and how we can use the movies effectively in literature and language teaching department. And we also discussed Breakfast at Tiffany's, specific movies, what should be the criteria of the selecting movies in ELT or interpretation purposes. Should we choose classical or modern movies? Or should the department overall syllabus be taken into consideration while we are choosing the featured movies? And how effectively could feature movies be used in our interpretation was our another subject. And today, as I have given you a very brief summary, what we have done so far at this studio, today we have again, uh, we are together again here at the studio, Professor Carlson, and, and lecturer Nurgul, Nurgul Hanım, and Dr. Chimanova and me. Today, first of all, we are going to <coughs> go over again, very quickly, a very quick overview of the future <coughs> movie watching project. What has been done or not achieved, successful or unsuccessful, date, time, and duration of movie watching session, and students' participation in the movies, feedbacks taken from the project so far, integrating the future movie into both departments' overall syllabus and curriculum. It should be considered as extracurricular activity or part of main part of the syllabus or curriculum. And then we're going to have general remarks at the end, and we're going to finish this program for this year. So this is going to be the last program of the 2015 and 2016 academic year at Media Manas. First of all, thank you very much for coming again, sir, and to be the ladies here. And as you see, and uh, we, I gave a very brief, brief, mm -hmm. I mean, very summary mm -hmm. of the what we have done so <coughs> far. Mm -hmm. uh, Professor Carlson, uh, would you please say something about it so far after this brief mm -hmm. summary? I think the uh, sessions have been successful in general. There are a few problems like participation has been low, uh, student motivation, getting the teachers to encourage their students to come, uh, in engaging uh, them in dialogue, uh, encouraging people to come. <clears throat> some of the other problems are that some of the students say that they've seen the movie, they don't want to come, they don't want to watch this movie again, they don't like it. But there should be other motivation. The fact, fact that we actually 
make a handout, uh, produce a handout, and this is an aid to the students that they can follow the movie, listen, uh, become familiar with the idioms that are used, the accent, the dialects that are used in the movie. So it's sort of a situational <coughs> uh, uh, opportunity for them to see language in action, to see language in the various situations that these movies uh, are set. We've had movies from the south, we've had movies from the north, and uh, show with different dialects, different, uh, and the students have an opportunity to see the var a variety in the English language, how the English language is used in films. And also for translation, simultaneous translation purposes, maybe uh, Nurgul can address this subject. How can the movies be useful in simultaneous translation? Uh, yeah, I w be before going into that, it just came up to my mind immediately. Mm -hmm. uh, if it is not going to be the part of the curriculum or mm -hmm. the, the <coughs> syllabus, yes. the core syllabus yes. of the departments, if we are going to show the movies, I mean, we're not going to, for we are going to show the movies to our students as extracurricular activity. Mm -hmm. Why not we can do that as a certificate program? Yes, yes. I mean, we can issue a certificate at the end. Mm -hmm. Who participates in the movie watching session and then who takes the exam at the end, a very big exam. Mm -hmm. So, who succeeds in the exam might have, uh, might take the, the certificate. So, it might be. It's another, it's another idea that just came up to my mind. It might be another solution to our, our project. But we announced before that uh, if they watched the movie, 10 movies, they would receive a certificate. Yeah, but we the couldn't end, make we them come and follow. Yeah, we haven't and followed that, up they, on they didn't pursue that. Because I mean, of participation. See, again. the participation is not very good. Right, right. That's a problem. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it should definitely be part of the curriculum. And I understand in your department, English department, there is actually a slot for this. That's Mo our department as well. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. You know, uh, Chopin had just said that there is a, it's scheduled in the program. There's a schedule, say, movie, movies showing. In the new program. In the new program or in the old program? In, in all. It was in old program. It was in the old program? Yes. New Not program. Now. Mm -hmm. Not now. Yes. But now, there's no, no okay. such kind of, such kind of, Subject. Course no, subject. There is no subject. How would yeah. we get it included? What are, used what's to the be. procedure for? It used to be, but procedures about that. Uh, I asked today about this Chopin idea, and she said that uh, there should be very strong, uh, um, serious, uh, let's say, uh, resources for that. Well, it is serious. I mean, the seriousness <laughs> has been <laughs> established. Don't we look for serious very much? <laughs> <laughs> the seriousness has been established already. Maybe they have to find out what. First of all, they have to find out what we have done so far. Yes. We have to tell them, but uh, we invite yeah. many times, many people here mm -hmm. to the studio and to discuss. It's in a way, but we are going to just carry out the project all yeah. the way down to the end. And the movies are not for entertainment purposes. No, no, no. To no, learn something, to uh, increase their knowledge. Yeah. As for simultaneous translation department, we have audiovisual translation lesson. Uh, this one is selected. Well, this one is... Uh, yeah, nowadays, before it was selective course, now this one is obligatory lesson, uh, twice a week. So one of the lessons we can make them watch these movies in order to translate them. And I, I think it, we can integrate this one uh, and get permission from our uh, head of department. What about the time element? Shouldn't overlap so with the department, with the courses? include this one into our schedule. Mm -hmm. How can we do so this? With oh. the help of the you know, the problem is there. Uh, I have my I have my concerns. The problem is there. The 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 department is English and Kyrgyz translation department. It's not English and Russian, English and Turkish. So the problem is there, and then we have to discuss very I mean in detail. It's, we're going to show the movies in Kyrgyz subtitle in English subtitle, in Turkish subtitle, or in Russian subtitle. So it's going to be one leg, not two leg. So and we're going to show the movies in English and interpret in English. 
subtitles would be in subtitles will be in English. Yeah. In English but it's not going to help them, I mean, at least at the very beginning to translate it simultaneously. I did that in the classroom, but here in movie watching session, first of all, we have to be we have to have a good command of of Kyrgyz or some other languages <laughs> to make them translate into another language. Right. And so maybe they, this should be discussed, right? Yes, it could be done in booths. Yes, we, it could be done in the booths. For example, we, we can would have to put before, a booth in the before studio. Simultaneous translation. We can try side translation. For example, they can see the subtitles, and they will sit in the booths and try to translate. It. Okay, Nurgulan, what do you think about the the movie watching session so far for the last almost seven months? After a brief summary. Saturday, uh, Saturday session. Show mm. the movies on Saturdays? Yes, on Saturdays, maybe. Saturday? Yes. Would students come? Yes. Uh, students students come? Will, they, will they say uh, they have lessons in the morning, and uh, in the afternoon they go home, and they don't come back? Or in the afternoon they have the lessons? So not all the students can come. And we can cannot change our schedule. I think we have to change the mentality first. Because students may not be able to go home immediately right after the class. Yes, they might stay here for a couple of hours, and mm -hmm. so we are paying attention. We are doing our best. Yep. Students don't realize the importance of the session. They've seen the movie. They've seen, in many cases, they've seen the movie, but they've seen it in Russian. So, yes, as, the, yeah. as the instructors, I mean, the lecturers, we have seen the movie many times. See, uh, as, I, as I have mentioned earlier, and when I wrote that book, and I watched the movies 10 times at least to find out what's going to be happening yeah, yeah. in the movie and to write down about it. In a movie so, like Breakfast at Tiffany's, yeah. I grew up with this movie. Well, we're not entertaining them. Yeah. It's an entertainment. And it's not, for yeah. freshmen, this yeah. one should be obligatory, I think, because when they come to audiovisual translation, they even there are some problems connected with uh, comprehension. Couldn't yeah. they report on the movie and say Kyrgyz or Turkish? They could report the movie, yes. you know, afterwards. They could uh, give summaries of the movies summaries. in their respective languages. This would be a translation exercise. So they would watch the movie and then summarize the movie in their respective languages, English, Turkish, or Kyrgyz. So, but is your remark about the, after the brief summary, about what we have done so far? Um, uh, from my side, I think that we have done really much things, many things, but um, maybe again participation. And uh, uh, I think if we just uh, schedule it for Saturday, I, I don't know, will they come on Saturday? Because they can say it is a weekend, they cannot just they go home. Yes, they should they go, go home. home. Maybe oh, just we should make some more advertisements to uh, invite them. Maybe just even graphic organizers in order yeah. to attract their attention, some, yeah. let's say, colorful. Yeah. And also uh, some other maybe motivating ideas. Maybe as Nikul uh, said that they cannot re realize the importance of these mm -hmm. sessions. Yeah, maybe they think that this is just entertaining, and I think that teachers just should work maybe a bit harder on this. So they have to motivate the students. Motivating, to come? yes, yes. For the watching session. Yes. But we always inform the students. I mean, the the lecturers over here, many times, and many times before the movie and after the movie, and they have to just. Work and, and be with us. Uh, be, they have to support us. Sure. Yes, of we course. We could also so, open, it up, open up to the prep courses. I talked to someone this morning, Nigel, who came up to my office for another mm -hmm. reason, but she says they didn't know anything about it. The, they would come. So no information. In the other buildings. And so in, in building the house there, yeah. yeah, yeah. As, far as, as far as the advertisement, for example, we can organize some kind of 
uh, as a contest after watching movies, for example. Connect on the movies, yes, they watched. Give a certificate? Uh, yes, certificates, maybe some other. Some it's an option, I mean, if we cannot put that here, I mean, in the curriculum, it's going to be another option mm -hmm. to invite the students to watch the movie, at least 10 movies, to get the certificate. And after the all, watching all the movies, they're going to have an exam at the end, not at the semester, at the end of the semester, both semesters, at the end of the year, academic year. And then they, they get, we're going to issue them certificate or watch, movie watching session. And I mean, as I mentioned before, it should be obligatory for the freshmen, because this one is connected also with the psychology of the students. For example, as you mentioned, they think this one is just an entertaining program, and most of them don't come to this net. For example, when you come <laughs> to the second quarter, when... Well, I, I cannot agree with you, I'm sorry, Norgulana, because I just, I just informed them a lot, many times, in, in the movie theater, you were there. Oh, yeah. This is not an entertaining program. This is not an entertainment. We also give them handouts, you know, before each yeah. movie. So you, you know yes. that very well. Uh, we do the same thing. But, yeah. Uh, I you think pass we out should handouts. find another solution to this problem. Yeah. We have to. We have because to. Because, yeah. as I mentioned, when they come to the second quarter, for example, uh, they have very low skills, for example, writing skills, speaking skills, communication skills. And uh, we, we should improve. Such we should train them. With the help of yeah. Such kind of activities. Theoretically, it should be open to anyone in the university. Yes. You know, theoretically. No, we should not and limit that with the students only. As yeah. Douglas mentioned, uh, more advertisements. Okay. And, so, uh, so you mean the advertisements? We just no, publicize. So even the communications division, you know, for, for students in journalism, students in. Uh, Yes, weekly we can just make some posters yes. and just uh, distribute them. Weekly, it is, it is not very easy. Just printing maybe mm, one sheet of paper. Yeah, but we can just, at the very beginning, we might have a program, all year program, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. all year schedule, and we might just publicize that. Yes. But every okay. week it is impossible. I mean, because we're going to prepare handouts, we're going to prepare the posters, and it is not easy because at, the, at that time there are a lot of posters around, mm. so they won't they won't so pay what, much attention you know, to that. One poster could have the whole schedule. Yeah, that's or why I mean we just, okay. just very I mean inform the students or publicize that at the very beginning of the year. But a large of, poster, this yeah. poster would not be taken down. It would mm -hmm. it would stay there. Yeah. You know. And in in each, in each every department, <clears throat> and bulletin one board they're gonna just put that or, or not sport. Yeah. Yes. put the old postures and they can just inform the students. What I would like to say here, unfortunately, we don't have any, any uh, I mean, we don't have satisfactory, satisfactory uh, backup from our department colleagues, unfortunately. So um, first of all, we have to make everything clear for them. What do you think? We yeah, one teacher up. One teacher refused, right? On principle. But anyway, this is a confession. <laughs> so, uh, you know, we, uh, we, 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 we let them watch 13 movies, as I have mentioned earlier. And anyway, we just tried to ca carry out the project to the end. And what do you think, what kind of feedback we got from our students? Just briefly, please. Let's start from you. Um, it was, I think, last week when we had our last interview with uh, two students. Isaac, yes, she is from our department, and we were just talking about these movie sessions. And uh, she said that, uh, frankly speaking, she just opened the secret that we do not often pay attention to the handouts, she said. And when I asked why, she said that nobody controls us, nobody checks it. And, uh, because there is no exam at the end. Yes, there is no exam, and maybe you are right that we <laughs> no should... No evaluation. Oh, we should arises, you know, the question of credit arises here. Yes. If they get credits, they get a grade. That's Grades why, that's why I mentioned about be. the student psychology. Yes, this, if this one is not obligatory. So yeah, we always concern about the student psychology. How about our psychology? We pay, we pay much attention to those things. 
and you give handouts, you work on that, you get nothing back. Yes, it happens like this. We just give them and we get nothing back. There is no feedback, it means. For example, uh, as for our department, in each course there are some responsible students. They come and take this handouts. Mm, the and same I, people. Uh, yes, and they, they don't say, uh, for example, some of them say that this film was interesting and so on. But, uh, but about handouts, uh, it is, they just, as Julius mentioned, they just don't pay attention, I think, to this one. Uh, yeah, you can tell me that you, it is a still psychology not to pay attention to <laughs> the things uh, given if by the no lecturers. Yes, if there is no example. Uh, we have to make them a motivator, right? I think yes. the only solution is to work it into a course, a course on movie. Movie has a... Which one is better? I mean, I'm not sure about that. And to put that into curriculum? In the curriculum. Yes. Or yes, to, put it to make it as a certificate program? No. Both. Well, curriculum. it could be both in, in the curriculum for credit and that they would receive some sort of certifi certificate or grade a number at the end. Yeah, but what is your suggestion, sir? To put that into curriculum, I mean, no. there is... There's going to be uh, the content, a very vast content, and be a course the, description. the evaluation Outcomes. and testing. You know, there has to be a course end. description, a curriculum, syllabus. This is, this is this is this is going to be not only this is going to be the the practical part, mm -hmm. mostly practical. There won't be any kind of I mean any any course books. Yeah, but it would be a course description, and then the syllabus would be week by week. The titles of the movies, and, the, and at the end they would get three hours of credit, three credit hours. I think three, yes, no. because and they would take an examination. Mm. I'm not sure about that. They're going to just accept our syllabus description, of course, description to Kyrgyz uh, National Education Council Ministry. Ministry. Ministry, but you can, yeah. Ministry. Do they have anything like this in other universities? Okay. In another university, so I, uh, yes. <laughs> never heard There's a course that. here on the Kyrgyz film, isn't there? Because they're always I would in say there. It is come. in terms of arts, and they can show the movies. But we are, you know, this is, this is for instructional purposes only. Mm -hmm. They don't use the, those movies for instructional purposes because that's from their department, mm -hmm. radio and television department. Mm -hmm. now, we are also using their movies in our department in, to serve our, for our purpose. Yes, yes. So it is going to be, it's going to take a lot of guts. I mean, uh, we have to work on that. And yes. uh, I, I don't know exactly, but I'm just still insisting on that. If you are not going to be able to put that into curriculum, why not? We just work on that. The, the movie watching session as a certificate program, but a real certificate program. Mm -hmm. non curriculum non credit I mean, non, non credit But non we have, we did it, yes, this year. We also... Yeah, but, but we, we couldn't get all of the students. Okay, because, because of Because some of the students did, did I mean, miss some of the movies, mm. only a, a couple of students, but at the very beginning of next year, we talk about that, I believe. So okay. no one student watched the movie ten times. Ah, yeah. Okay. No one student did this. Uh, we are going to just, we're going to give a very short quiz or exam just before starting the next year and we watch a session but we can, if we can uh, if we are able to find the same students in the in the exam session I mean so we're gonna just give the certificate if they just make it yes because no chance to check up as we mentioned before and also we can also organize some kind of contest between two departments yes English language yeah and, uh, and it's okay, and no problem. Well. We can have co some some contests, competition, but yeah. competition, for example, like it would be at the same time, uh, entertaining program. Mm -hmm. Yes, we can use some kind of music songs and also in the film. Um, yes, connected to poetry. And, and as they yes. did in, with My Fair Lady, you know the George Bernard yes. Shaw. Yes, they yes. actually played. They staged it. Yes. Yes. Staged it. They staged the movie. Yeah. Oh, you staged more, yeah? Yes, they staged it. Mm. Yes. 
Yeah, it uh, can I mean this one. This is it an activity good that you do. Yes. Okay, we are trying to find solutions, as you see, ladies and gentlemen. And finally, we, we decided on that. If we cannot make it into, into the curriculum, do you agree with me? Uh, it might be an extracurricular activity, a uh, certificate program, right? Yes. A certificate program. Yes, yes. Yeah, I mean, uh, and contest is another thing. Certificate yeah. program with contest. And then we have to examine the schedule quizzes. to find a suitable time. When yeah. yeah. Yes. But we are free. going to try to, to put that into the syllabus. Oh, at the end we can have, we might have a survey, I mean, yes, uh, a questionnaire. Also, I think we can do like this, for example, in our f uh, first and second year students, we have a class spoken, speaking skills, improv speaking yes, yeah. improvement. And maybe, uh, so every week we will show them movie, yes, a movie, and uh, during the class I can say that, please, I'm giving you a task to write a say on that movie. Mm -hmm. And I will check it, I will control and be, give some grades. Which also be we have to get more yeah. teachers to do this. Yeah, well, and they will be motivated to get more grades. Okay, you partly integrate that into your curriculum. Yeah, partly. Partly, mm -hmm. not, not officially. <laughs> not officially. <laughs> okay, <laughs> but we are we are seeking, right? Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, some chances to mm -hmm. put that into curriculum officially. Yeah. For example, in my writing class, I could get students to summarize the movies written in written form. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, I think we came to the end. Any suggestion or any ideas as closing remarks? No, first the next session would be in October, right? Beginning in October? We would uh, yeah, most probably. Uh, not, not just <coughs> till, the, till the middle of the October, you won't do anything. In Germany, I'll look for more films. I brought all these films from Germany, and they, they all have some. You yeah, we can find those out. kind of films everywhere nowadays. Yeah, mm -hmm. but even their subtitles in Turkish, because yeah, there I, are at yeah, least three yeah. or four languages, right? Subtitles. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. And is it possible to include other genres, for example, like educational programs and documentary films, not only movies? <coughs> yeah, we we can. We could. I mean, we will, I mean, once we just just integrate that into the curriculum. Mm -hmm. yeah. We are going to work on the course description, mm -hmm. the, the movie selection session, yeah. Because movie selection. Right. National Geographic yeah. has very good yes, We have to, yes. Yeah. A lot of, a lot of oh, documentary yes. movies then. Yep. Mm -hmm. Many. Mm -hmm. Okay. And Anything? maybe one more suggestion that if we just, we are going to be free till October, we Who just... Said we are going to be free <laughs> till October? I mean, <laughs> yes. No I mean, no interviews, no sessions, maybe. Uh, we will just try to uh, work on the, some ideas uh, uh, in order to improve these movie sessions uh, some more. Means, uh, we have to come together and have a meeting, right? Yes. Uh -huh. Is it a suggestion? <laughs> yes, a suggestion. Are there universities yeah. in Turkey that have courses on movies? In some universities, yeah. In Turkey? I, had in, I Turkey. had in my university after I wrote that book and for a couple of years, yeah. Uh -huh. It's very wonderful. You had a course, right? Um, yeah, we, we part of part of curriculum in prep lang prep classes, uh -huh. Uh -huh. not in the department classes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was uh, at least tour tour for for hours a week. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, anything to add? No, Thank you very much for coming. Session. And today we discussed, as you see many things here just before closing our program for this year and next year we we are keeping our fingers crossed to integrate our project into the curriculum of the departments or to make it as a certificate program thank you very much and hope to see you next year next semester and next academic year goodbye